Whether I like it or not, my life has also been in constant play with what the world calls success. Success is a wonderful thing, but it tends not to be the sort of experience that we learn from. We enjoy it, perhaps we even deserve it, but we don't acquire wisdom from it. And maybe that's why it cannot be passed on either. Me being successful does not mean my kids are going to be successful, even if I teach them everything that I know and how to do it. So I feel that talking about success is completely a big waste of time. Instead, let me tell you very honestly, whatever happened to me happened because I've always been terrified of failure. I don't want as much to succeed as much as I don't want to fail. I come from a very normal, lower middle class family. I saw a lot of failure. My father was a beautiful man and the most successful failure in the world. My mother also failed to stay long, long enough with me to see me become a big movie star. We were quite poor actually and let me tell you, poverty is not an ennobling experience at all. Poverty entails fear and stress and sometimes depression. I watched my parents go through this several times. At an early age after my parents died, I equated poverty with failure. I just didn't want to be poor. So when I got a chance to act in films, it wasn't out of any creative desire, I say this honestly. It was purely out of the fear of failure and poverty. Most of the films I signed were discards of better known actors and the producers could not find anyone else to do them. I did them all to make sure that I was working to, av to avoid unemployment. The timing or something was right, I worked very hard, there were other people around it and I became a big star, the films became big hits. Which means sometimes our success is not the direct result of our actions and let nobody tell you that. Success sometimes just happens, really. It is accidental and we have to take credit for it. I do it sometimes surely out of embarrassment. So I believe the true path to success is through the fear of failure. If you aren't scared enough to, of failing, you're unlikely to succeed. It's not pleasant to fail, it's tough. All of us experience it. You will too, if you haven't already. So use it to succeed. How I've done is, a few points I'd like to say, and then I'll end this monologue. Firstly, it's not the absence of failure that makes you success, that makes success. It is your response to failure that actually helps to buffer the reverses that you experience. I personally have one response to failure, pragmatism. A recognition and belief that if one approach does not work, then the other will or might. Failure also gives me an incentive to greater, greater exertion, harder work, which invariably leads to later success in most cases. Repeated failure has taught me to stop pretending I'm someone else. Failure also gets you to find who your real friends are. The true strength of your relationships only gets tested in the face of strong adversity. Overcoming some of my failures has made me discover that I have a strong will and more discipline than I suspected. It has helped me to have confidence in my ability to survive. Failure is an amazing teacher, so do fail and it's all right to fail. And when you fail, you fail well enough to succeed the next time. Don't be afraid of being afraid. Be afraid of not facing your fears and failures. And failure is your fiendish friend. Keep him close. God bless you. Thank you very much.